guys, my name is Ishan. Welcome to my channel. This is probably one of the first videos that I am doing. If you haven't yet, please go ahead and like and subscribe. I will be doing two wig reviews today. Um, they are the same name brand. Um, I can't think of it right now, but it is a company from Amazon. They were both $20. Now, I did do some research on this wig, and I saw a lot of people with like the black one, and they had finessed it. They looked so pretty so i wanted to see what like they will like look like in different colors and like would the texture be the same or would it be different or whatnot so i'll leave the link below the description of the wigs if you ever if you decide like later on and at the end of the video you want to take a look at them yourself they're only 20 dollars each the first wig did come with some earrings and a little card with their logo and on the back it has some information on how like to share and like and whatnot this is the package that they came in cute little package nothing fancy but you know actually now I'm thinking about it I think they look different so this is one package as far as the curl types honestly I have seen worse for synthetic wigs so I'm not 100% disappointed um, it does have some fizziness going on but this is what they look like underneath oh and I do apologize I didn't mention it before one of my wigs I got it in burgundy um, it looks like it's like an ombre burgundy like it starts burgundy and then turns red at the bottom um, did not expect that and then the other one was ombre blonde which this kind of looks not really it don't really look like the color that it showed on the pictures but you know Amazon do be taking any pictures from someone else so I'm not surprised so this one's also a little bit frizzy like the curls don't look like some of them be popping like you can see some of them is popping and then some of them is just like wow but this is the construction they come with clips and electric elastic bands that you can kind of hook to the back for the smaller hairs or whatever. Let's get into it. I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the blonde wig, so let's get into this. Okay, so it has bangs. Let me make these tighter. Not super tight because I'm getting small, but it ain't big either. But. Woo. Okay, I am looking like say like mixed with Tina Turner golden girl okay we don't have to we don't have to play with this because this okay I see a vision I see something something but I'm gonna try to cut it and fluff it out and see what I can do maybe I'll have it all straight see what I can do with this Try to shape because like there's no reason that my veins can't see my face. Okay, see my face a little bit more. Do this up. Do this more in the front. I thought it would be it's a little bit different than what the photo showed I honestly think the photo is the girl's real hair because it doesn't look like the curl pattern is not like this and the blonde is not like it's not terrible but it's not the blonde that they show the ombre blonde that they show in the pictures and I think I'm just making it frizzier which for me is okay because I think it makes it look less shiny which plastic synthetic wigs tend to be but 
That's the blonde one. Okay, is red, is burgundy my color? Ooh, got caught there. I'm not gonna lie, I've always wanted a red, not red, I've always wanted like a burgundy looking wig. I'm not even gonna lie, like I really did. This one looks like it has more volume and it's shorter. Right there, it feels like it's shorter. Maybe I'm just tripping. But same thing here, I'm gonna go ahead and snip, snip, snip at these bangs because like why? Once again, I don't know where I'd wear this to, but I'm not mad at the burgundy one. I think I like this one a little bit better. I still need to get rid of that. And same with this one, like some of the curls are popping. Like, I don't know if you can see it, but they're doing that. And then some of them just, they just fall short. You know what? I like this. I do. I don't. I don't know what it is about this one, but I like this. Still want to find a way to like get rid of some of this shine that's happening. Okay, so I'm gonna play with these a little bit more, and I'm gonna give it like try them out over a couple weeks or whatever, try to wear them out, try to find something to wear them with because, I don't know, this is like big. It's soft though, I will give it that. It's, it's super, it's super soft. Oh, I like, I like this one. It's a look for me. It's a look for me. Ooh, child, I like this. Tell me what y'all think in the comments, cause like, you know what, they did something with this. Like, I need to figure out how to make it less shiny, but it's cute, like, like it's cute. Like, when my hair is really this big and this, when my hair is curly, but it ain't this type of curl, I will wear it like this. Except for these ends, like, what's up with these ends? You know what, I'm gonna try the blonde one back on and see if I can get it kind of like a little pinky too. Cause I'm kind of, I'm feeling this. I'm, I'm feeling this, I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this, so. Fluffing it out so you can like skip past the fluffing. Maybe, maybe I'm okay with the blonde. Try to make it bigger. You know what? I actually do like. I, I like this one a little bit. I don't like it as much as the burgundy one, but this one, this one's kind of cute too. Like I could get, I could get used to it. Put some makeup on, some darker makeup to bring out my features or whatever. But that's all I have for you today. This is my, this is my blonde. That was my burgundy. They were only 20 bucks on Amazon. Once again, go ahead and like and subscribe um, and leave your comments. That's it.